Now, I love to eat, so I don't mind shelling out some cash to have a really good meal. However, I also love finding really delicious but good value meals here in London. So in this video, I'm gonna tell you about five of my favorite affordable meals that you can get in the city while you're here. In each of these spots, you can expect to pay less than 15 pounds per person for a meal, not including drinks, of course. Let's start with Pavilion Cafe. It's located in Victoria Park in East London, and this is truly a local favorite. All the locals love going here. They're known for doing really good coffee, really good pastries, but when you want a good hearty breakfast, then you go and you get the Sri Lankan breakfast. This is what I always get when I go. It's made up of dal coconut sambal and string hoppers. And it's really filling. I usually end up having some of it for lunch because I get too full from breakfast. And the beauty of it is it is just 10 pounds. Good prices for London. And at Pavilion, you go inside and you order. And then there are some tables that are sat right next to the beautiful lake. So you can have your breakfast in a beautiful setting. Next up is something that I was introduced to by my friend Shu, and you might remember it and her from my Street Eats to Try in London video. And this is at Chinese Tapas House and they sell Zhan Bing. Zhan Bing is like a sort of Chinese crepe. It's made with egg and then it's stuffed with a bunch of different things and you get to choose what it's stuffed with. You can do beans, lettuce, peanuts, different types of meat. I mean, there's lots of options. Jianbing is a popular street food in China and you can eat it at really any time of the day. Now, one Jianbing is super filling, so you might want to chop it in half and share it with a friend if you're not super hungry when you're having it. But even so, just one of them is only five pound 50. It's like one of the most affordable street foods that you can find in London. You go into Chinese tapas house, you order your jianbing, and then you can go around the corner to where they have some tables in Chinatown and you can enjoy it there. This video is sponsored by Questo. Questo is an app filled with city exploration games created by locals. Explore London and other destinations by solving challenges in your surroundings while discovering interesting stories and learning about hidden gems along the way. Each game is unique and created around a theme with an element of role playing as well. I actually created a game that will take you around Bermondsey, teaching you about the local history, past inhabitants, and interesting quirks. So click the link in the description box to download the free Questo app, go to the London section and grab my Bermondsey game. And even if you don't plan to get to London soon, there are games and cities around the world. Then we've got Arepa & Co, a Venezuelan restaurant that serves delicious cachapas and arepas and other Venezuelan treats for breakfast, brunch, lunch, and dinner. I always go for the vegetarian cachapa, which is like a pancake that's filled with black beans, avocado, plantains, and cheese. And then you get your choice of sauce to drizzle all over it. The cachapa on its own is £9.50, but if you go for lunch during the week, they have this lunch deal where you can get a main, which is either an arepa or a cachapa, and you get their freshly squeezed lemonade. That's really good. And all of that's only for £8.50. The staff is really cool here, by the way. They're always really nice. Uh, the atmosphere is very chill no matter what time that you go, very relaxed. And they've got two locations, one in Bethnal Green and one in Hagerston. Now we can't do a cheap eats video without talking about some pizza. And we've got lots of really good affordable pizza places here in London, but today we're gonna talk about Purezza. Purezza is in Camden and they do some really good, sort of inventive, but still Italian style pizzas that are, I'm telling you, they're so good. And the thing about Purezza is that the entire restaurant is fully vegan. And both meat lovers and vegans and vegetarians all love it. So cool your chops if you're worried about it being vegan. They do ingredients like andouille and sausage and pulled porchetta on the pizzas, all vegan obviously. And it's like the stuff that us vegetarians and vegans might be missing a little bit or would like to have on pizza or have had it on pizza in the past. Um, now we can have it because Purezza does it. One of their pizzas is award-winning. It actually beat out in a competition a bunch of like really crazy meat pizzas. So. It's good. When you go, make sure you also try the dough balls because they're known for those as well. 
Another cheapie that I have loved for so long in London is Club Mexicana. They do kind of like a modern take on Mexican street food. And this is another place that is fully vegan, but still freaking delicious. I don't know how they do it. Now, I personally always get their cheeseburger tacos. They just have a sauce in it that's like, it's a cheeseburgery, cheesy sauce that it just makes it so good so good but their other tacos are really good like their buffalo mushroom one love that one as well they also do burritos and nachos basically everything here is fantastic they've got two very casual locations where it's kind of like order your food and then sit at a nearby table one is in carnaby and one is at seven dials market if you want more ideas for where you can eat inexpensively in london but still good then check out my Street Eats video, which is popping up right over here. And for more tips for your trip to London, then click the other box that's popping up over here to watch another video.